Hey guys, James here with Water for Business Solutions, and today we're going to continue our House Call Pro QuickBooks Online Sync Errors and talk about sales tax rate errors. So when we have QuickBooks and House Call Pro connected, we can push sales tax back and forth between both systems, i.e. when you charge 7% sales tax in House Call Pro, we can go ahead and also charge that 7% in QuickBooks so that it records the liability of the fact that we owe those taxes. We can then run a report through QuickBooks that will show us how much we owe in taxes. So it's a very nice system there when set up correctly. However, there's two major things that we need to consider. First and foremost is for a while there, QuickBooks was only using a system called AST or Automatic Sales Tax. What that means is QuickBooks is system uses the address that you use and recalculates the customer and their tax that you charge based on that address. But what we couldn't do is put in custom sales tax rates. With House Call Pro, we don't have that by the address calcula calculation. We have to put in specific rates in our settings. And so when we come here to settings and company profile, we would put in each of these by hand. What needs to happen is we need to have a matching rate by the exact same rate number and name in QuickBooks. If we don't have that, it's going to cause an issue. With AST, we weren't easily able to set that up because you couldn't put in custom rates. So now QuickBooks in America has come up with the HST system. And for my Canadian people, this is not your harmonized sales tax or anything like that. This is hybrid sales tax. This is m mainly going to apply to people in America because Canada has not changed their sales tax system at all. Theirs is still the same. It was the American version that got screwed up here. So now there's a version called hybrid sales tax. With that hybrid sales tax, it will do that auto recalculation but we can also come in and we can set up custom rates like we used to be able to. So I'm gonna go ahead and go into QuickBooks, show you where the sales tax is there, and then we will go from there. Okay guys, so now we're in QuickBooks and I'm in the sales tax setting area in QuickBooks. When we see a sales tax setting area that looks like this, so you'll find this by going to taxes and sales tax, if you're given that option, and then sales tax settings, if we see one that looks like this, this means that we have HST or the hybrid sales tax system because it allows us to put in these custom rates. So the first thing we always want to do to avoid issues with the House Call Pro QuickBooks integration is to always add our rates here. So whatever we name a rate in House Call, we want to make sure we do that exact same thing in QuickBooks. I'm going to show you another route around this in a minute, but I don't want you to use this route all the time. So let's say we're going to add a new tax rate in here, and I'm going to name it Florida at 8%. So now House Call Pro is going to have a tax rate of Florida at 8%. So I want to come in here in QuickBooks and do the exact same thing and do Florida choose who my agency is at 8%. Now you can also do single and combined to do custom rates here. Generally, it's just gonna be a single rate. Um, if you want more information on sales tax and setting sales tax up, I do have a video specifically on that. I'm not gonna dig into that. But now that we've set up this here, from then on out, whenever we choose Florida in house call, as long as we've named it exactly the same, same capitalization, same spaces, same everything with the exact same rate, we're not going to run into any errors. The other option that we have is when we come into house call and we end up with an error here. And we've got this error here that's saying Georgia was not found. We can always reprocess this error. And when we reprocess this error, we can go ahead and create a either match to a current rate or create a new QBO tax rate. 
So let's say we want to create a new QBO tax rate. What it's going to do is it's going to push that tax rate in. It's going to clear that error in QuickBooks. It's going to push that tax rate over for us. And then we should see a new custom rate in QuickBooks. It doesn't always happen immediately. And I'm looking at this pretty quickly. So don't be surprised that it's not here. Um, but now that we've created a custom rate in house call and we've matched it, we're not going to run into that issue anymore because we've made a match there. So one thing to keep in mind with is your best off, your best bet is to set everything up through QuickBooks. It's going to be streamlined, it's going to show up better, and it's going to look better long term. But if you don't have the HST system activated on your QuickBooks, and you still are on the old AST system, your only solution is going to be to create those custom rates and reprocess or spend eh, anywhere from a week or two arguing with QuickBooks to get them to fix it. It's kind of a pain. That's why I don't recommend arguing with QuickBooks. Just go with the create custom rate here or match to a rate that's already in there and reprocess. If you match to a rate or you create a custom rate, you do have a higher likelihood of that error popping back up again because it will not always show a custom rate here. So over time, House Call Pro may forget that that custom rate exists and will then basically forego that connection and you'll have to reset it up again. So that's why setting up through here is your best bet. The other thing is if you try to charge taxes through house call and you haven't even set up sales tax in QuickBooks, you're not going to be able to do anything. You have to come in and turn on and set up sales tax in QuickBooks before you start setting up any type of taxes in, in house call pro. So that's the sales tax rate errors. It's a fairly easy one to fix. I do strongly recommend that you go through and fix it through QuickBooks because long term it's going to give you more information, it's going to keep the integration working better, and it's going to look a whole lot better. Um, but you can always do the easier route here that may come back to haunt you later on. If you have questions or if you need some more help or this isn't solving your issue, please feel free to reach out to me at Waterford Business Solutions. Give us a call, shoot us an email, or you can reach out to the blue chat bubble with House Call Pro and they may be able to help you out there too. As always, have a wonderful rest of your day.